Hey everybody, how's it going? This is, uh, I guess I'm just going to give a week update, um, on my, my, uh, my surgery progress. So, I shot the video, what, last Wednesday and uploaded it, and I was talking about how great I feel. Um, this Wednesday, I go back in, they're going to take out the rest of these and install the studs. I don't know if I'll have the dentures then or not. That hasn't really been discussed. Wow, this image is very crooked. There we go. I have a flexible uh, tripod, and it's wrapped around my steer wheel right now. I don't have a car mount. I probably should. Anyway, so I want to talk a little bit more about this process because I'm trying to help people alleviate any fears that they have over the um, dental work. What I, one thing I can say is it's been a week. I actually, it's 1.53 now. It was about 2 o'clock when I started this surgery, so it literally has been a week. So, one of the things I can say is, oh my god, like, uh, no matter how bad your fear is, now, I was horrible. I really just could not see the possibility of going in for dental work. It was just, at, like, my fear was bad. And if I knew, like, I knew that I would feel better, but if I knew that I would feel this much better, I would have, I would have stepped in a chair a long time ago, or sat in a chair a long time ago. Um, I, I'm having a hard time eating, and i got to be honest, um, I'm getting kind of tired of Wawa macaroni and cheese. <laughs> Because uh, that's one of the things I can eat very easily. Um, I can eat a lot of things easily right now, but you know, a lot like the other day. I, uh, if you ever see them, let me get a, a picture of them because these things are amazing. I, I gotta be. I love pickles a lot, and um, so I ended up having to like chop them up like I'm giving them to a child. Um. These, uh, oh, no, I don't want to do it like that. These Dietz and Watson uh, pickles are amazing. But I had to, like I said, chop them up like <laughs> give them to a child. Uh, it's kind of sad. But once I actually have the full dental work done, I'm going to be able to eat whatever I want. But, uh, <laughs> but, like, I wake up and I'm no longer, like, finding blood in my mouth. Um, my my jaws have started to uh, uh, constrict. I guess would be a good word, because you said that your jaw, your your gum line will uh, shrink, which is why they want to wait until you're healed to do anything. Uh, so, one of which is there's a stitch right here that uh, I guess because the the jaw has shrunk. I can literally like spin the stitch around and I was going to call them when I first because it, it first happened Saturday I was going to call them and ask if there was anything I should do but I'm like you know it's not bleeding it the, it's not like the wound has popped open so you know I don't want to do that I don't know how I'm going to go about doing the updates on this because um the let me turn this just a little bit. Oh, now you're crooked again. I want to get, get more centered in the shot. Uh, I don't know how I'm going to go about doing the updates because I know Wednesday surgery is going to be all the teeth gone and then there's going to be the studs. As near as I can tell by looking at pictures online um, of it, let me... I know I have a picture in my phone um, that was from Messenger. It looks like they're going to be pretty low in the gum line. I'll try to remember to put this up there. And I know they're pretty low in the gum line, so I don't think it's really going to affect the way I talk too much without them. You know, without the dentures in there, so... 
I'm probably going to sound still like this, but yeah, anyway, I can't even stand hearing myself talk right now. That's the only real negative effect that I found on this. And, uh, but yeah, this thing, has, this whole process has been pretty much painless. I can't say that it's been 100% painless, but like, uh, one of the things I forgot to mention when, uh, when, uh, when I did my last video is, like, when he removed the tooth, you feel, like, you know how, like, if you, you pull your finger, you'll feel pressure, but you, it doesn't hurt. That's how it felt coming out, like, there was no pain, he just felt a pressure, and, like, he, he was taking out the second tooth, and I'm like, wait a minute, that's it? This is what I've feared <laughs> this whole time and uh yeah it, it's been a remarkable ride at this point because I I had let fear um control me for so long about this that I can't imagine like I just never imagined that it would be this good that everything would be this fine, you know? <sighs> Man, I, I just really wish I could find the words to uh, really convey what I'm thinking. And I think, and I'm pretty sure most people understand. Like, you're absolutely, literally terrified because, like, you know, when you watch videos, like, if, when you watch TV and stuff, the... You know, these dentists literally look like mad scientists and, you know, all, like in movies and TV shows, you know, pe the dentist is hurting people and stuff like that. But, you know, I for the first time ever, my kid, uh, I've never watched uh, Finding Nemo and uh, my kid was watching it the other day and I'm just kind of like, paying it. I didn't realize that he ended up in... Uh, is Nemo the dad? I don't remember. I wasn't really paying attention, but, like, it ended up in a fish tank in a dentist, all, like, in an actual dentist exam room. I'm like, uh, no, a dental exam room is a clean environment. <laughs> you wouldn't have a fish there. But, uh, anyway, I don't really want to go rambling on too much. But I want to give an update that, like... I feel absolutely fantastic after doing this, and I can't wait. Like, I'm really excited. I'm still a little nervous because I know that the next procedures are going to be a little more advanced. But, if it's anything like what I've been through already, thank you for watching. Have a blessed day. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and check out any other videos. There might be some showing up somewhere here on the screen. Have a good one.